Bonjour everyone, my name is Noah. And I'm Sal. Damn, you're good. I caught on. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel, and for this video, we're here in Chicago. It is Valentine's Day weekend, and I believe President's Day weekend. So Sal and I decided to take a little weekend trip from New York to Chicago. It's our first time coming to the city, so we're really excited to you know, explore and just see what it has to offer. Of course, we chose the best weekend in the year, and it's currently 10 degrees Fahrenheit or negative 15 degrees Celsius. So we got out of the airport and we're freezing already. <laughs> but we basically just flew here after work. We just got to our hotel, which is the Palmer House Hotel. Palmer House? Palmer House Hotel in downtown Chicago. It looks pretty old as you can see in the background. It reminds me of American Horror Story. Yes, American definitely. Horror Story Hotel. So hopefully we don't die here this weekend. But we're here for three days. We don't have anything crazy planned, but we do have a lot of recommendations that people have been sending me. So we have a lot to do and to explore. Right now, I think it's about 7.30 p.m. We're about to just get set on the room and then probably walk around to just explore the surroundings and see what the neighborhood is like. And then we have a dinner reservation for Valentine's Day at 10. Doesn't want to tell me what the name of the place is. There's a little surprise for Valentine's Day, so I'm excited. Hopefully the food is good because this man doesn't. I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, yeah, it's going to be a good night. And then maybe after we'll go out. Not sure. Depends on their energy level. But yeah, let's just go and explore. noise <laughs> baby if we die here I'm blaming you a hundred percent so just as planned it is very very cold but it's really nice downtown reminds me a lot of New York a lot less busy but right now we're walking towards Millennium Park and we're just gonna go and see what the area is about <gasps> wait I haven't seen snow in so long quite disappointing really <laughs> all right so we made it to Millennium Park and we can't really do that weather anymore so we're gonna go to that bar restaurant called cindy's that is right across the street from millennium park that my friend told me about and said that the view was crazy and that it was really good for drinks before or after dinner so we're gonna go and check it out and hopefully i don't die why the f did i just cross that street <laughs> So we just got to a dinner place, which turned out to be Bandera, which is, I believe, just a Hellstone Chicago version. It's one of my favorite restaurants in Miami, LA, and New York, and I'm always super excited when we go, so Sal surprised me this time, so we're here. So the exciting thing about this location is that they have live jazz music all night. So I'm gonna have to get the usual, which is gonna be the barbecue ribs and Sal's craving the spinach artichoke dip. And yeah, we're just gonna listen to jazz music and look at each other and yeah. <laughs> Let me tell you your fortune. Okay, so we are back at the very scary hotel. You can hear all the noise that it's making. I'm gonna cry. So we finished our dinner at Hillstone. It was amazing. I love the food there. I love the atmosphere. It was just a great night. And we just decided to come back to the hotel, have a night in. I actually forgot to wrap Sal's Valentine's Day present. So I just took it out of my suitcase and ran out of the room. So I got him this rag and bone shirt that we saw together. It's like basically just a regular t-shirt. It has a little rat with a pizza on the chest. And he saw it and he loved it because he loves pizza. It's been his favorite dish. And then as a joke, I also got him Flaming Hot Cheetos popcorn. That was my favorite thing in the world is Flaming Hot Cheetos. And I'm gonna wrap these with some red ribbon that I got and just surprise him. And then I guess we're just gonna have a night in and then we'll wake up tomorrow for breakfast and then to finally explore Chicago during the day. All right, good night. <laughs> Oh, 
Bonjour everyone. So today is our first full day here in Chicago. We're grabbing brunch with my friend Tyler at Cafe Baba Riba, which is like a Spanish place. And then probably go to either the museum or the aquarium. Found it. Wait, I'm so confused. Oh, oh my god. Oh, <laughs> I hate this. So for some reason, I'm just remembering that now, but Chicago is the city in which Divergent, which was one of my favorite book series growing up, took place. So now we're seeing a lot of things and the environment in general, and it's reminding me of the movies, and I really want to watch it again. But at least I'm here, and I'm going to get to explore and go to every faction. So we've just been walking around on Michigan Avenue, and it's actually crazy how there's absolutely everything here but the people are 12,000 times nicer than they are in New York like everyone's asking how you are they're making conversation it doesn't seem like big or anything at all they're just genuinely asking so it's really nice and now we're on our way to that cafe to grab brunch I'm still kind of full but I'm really excited because we looked at the menu and it looked really good <laughs> Okay, I didn't feel much, but we just got out of brunch, which was a tapas style restaurant. It was really good. Once again, I'm really full. What the f is that? <laughs> <laughs> but right now, we just made it to the Shed Aquarium, which is located in the Museum Plaza. I think that's what he said it was called. We have the three big museums, so now we're gonna go and see some fishies. And there's snow everywhere. Yes. Are you cold? It's so cold. <laughs> oh my god, that eyeshadow is so pretty though. So we got back to the hotel after the aquarium and we're just laying in bed before we said we go to the gym and we're watching Patrick's Fashion Week <laughs> vlogs and at one point we can see Ronnie it's who's just lying. at a fashion show, yeah. And you can hear one sound. <laughs> That's Ronnie right there. Okay, so we just finished watching Patrick's Fashion Week vlogs, where, by the way, I get bullied a lot, and now Sal doesn't believe me that I don't have an OnlyFans. Daddy got me boba. Daddy got me boba. Daddy got me boba. OnlyFans crazy. Oh my god. <laughs> but it is now 7 p.m., so I think it's time we head to the gym, Sal. Okay, so we're gonna go to the gym, then we'll just come back here, shower, get ready, and then head to dinner. Someone was craving some Chicago-style pizza. <laughs> he loves pizza so much, it's his favorite dish, and we've never had deep dish pizza, have you? No. So he's really excited. Bonjour, so I took a little bit of a break from vlogging this morning, but last night we ended up going to Flash, which is a gay club in Boys Town, which is a little up north of Chicago, and it's the gay district where all the clubs and bars are at. Um, we met up with a friend of mine and just had a great night over there, and then this morning we've just been walking around downtown Chicago, and I'm just really liking it. It reminds me a lot of the neighborhood in which I work in New York, which is the financial district, and right now we're about to go up the Sky Deck on Willis Tower, which is probably the second most touristy thing we could do after the thing yesterday. That tower up there, and there's a really cool view up there that I hope we can take pictures in. It's like a glass box, you've probably seen it everywhere. That's the plan right now. So <laughs> we said no pizza. <laughs> We'll get it tomorrow. Okay, so never mind about this sky deck because it turns out that there is a two hour wait 
today because it's really sunny and it's Sunday so people are out. So we're just gonna do that tomorrow and right now we're about to grab some food. I think Sa wanted us to get Italian beef which I think is like a Chicago thing that we haven't tried so we're going to walk to a place that's called Al's Beef which is Italian beef. I think one of the best places for Italian beef. Whatever that means. Yeah, I don't even know what that is. So we got two Italian beef sandwiches with provolone cheese and some chili cheese fries just because we had to. I want to see you take a bite. <gasps> They're not big. No, because Ian and I are going Mm -hmm. I like this. So we just finished eating those Italian beef sandwiches and I feel like I said that already seven times in this vlog but we are both so full again and now we are on our way to Roscoe's which is I think another bar in Boys Town to meet with friends. We're also googling when the Navy Pier is open until because there's a ferry swill up there that we really wanted to go up on. Never mind it closes at 7 tonight so We'll go tomorrow. <laughs> so we're here with Alvin. Hi guys. He's showing us all the gay spots in Chicago. But the literally just moved here yesterday. <laughs> Still our expert though. Oh my god. Come here. Come here. Are you straight? So we just got out of the bar and we ended up staying there a lot longer than we had planned. It's now about 10.30 p.m. and both a little tired. So we're just gonna head to the hotel and start watching Divergent because Chicago just made us want to watch it again. And I think Sa wants to grab up some pizza. Are we surprised? Because I'm not. So we have one half pepperoni and one half sausage. And we are watching Divergent. Good morning, so today's our last day. It's Monday, President's Day, so we're just packing up the room. We're about to check out of the hotel, and then we have pretty much the whole day kind of here in Chicago before our flight tonight at 6.30. We have a couple of things we wanted to do. We want to go up Willis Tower because we couldn't yesterday. And if we have time, I want to go to the pier. We'll see. And we also have to grab lunch at some point. Unsure. Hopefully he doesn't want pizza again because I can't do it anymore. <laughs> Where are we going? Tower. Where is that? Over there. <laughs> of course. So we just waited like 45 minutes and of course there's clouds. We can see. <laughs> Babe, are you actually scared? <laughs> No. I literally never felt like that. The second I saw that and I, I couldn't get over it, I, I froze. So we just went on the ledge at the sky deck thing, which is like a glass box, even the floor is glass. And you only have 60 seconds to like get in and get your pictures because there's a line. So I was like, okay, let's go. And Sal steps on it and goes, babe, I can't do this, I can't do this. Are you okay? Yeah. <laughs> Are literally stopped. <laughs> Maybe everyone was looking and he was like, no, I can't, I can't. So we just got out of Willis Tower and unfortunately we won't have time to make it to the pier before we need to go to the airport for a flight, which is probably not bad because it started snowing. So I'm not even sure that the Perry School will be open and it's probably just a better thing to do in the summer. So right now we're on our way to the hotel to pick up our suitcase and then we're gonna Uber to the Global McDonald's, which is, I believe, a McDonald's location where they have global recipes of stuff that is sold around the world. And that's because McDonald's headquarters is in Chicago. So they just have this special restaurant, which I'm really excited for. And of course, he had to get sweet green because he can't follow me on my McDonald's way. I can't believe I'm saying McDonald's. The only way to say McDonald's is McDo. And you can't change my mind. <laughs> <gasps> okay, okay. They have a triple cheeseburger? Yeah, you didn't know that? Oh, I'm in America. 
All right, so we ended up getting two orders of the winter fries, which are French, and then there's a Thai sweet chicken sandwich, which is from the Canadian menu. And then we have those hazelnut cream slash Nutella beignets, which are from the Spanish menu. So I'm really excited. Are you ready for your salad, sweetheart? Yes. <laughs> this is amazing. <laughs> I love sweet and sour sauce and everything. <laughs> mm. Canada really has it all, huh? I just, I just don't understand. This looks so painful. This is so delicious. <laughs> all right, you guys, so I did get my additional sandwich to go for McDonald's, and then we just drove straight to the airport. It's about 6.05 p.m. right now. Our flight leaves in 30 minutes, so we probably have to go and board, but I thought I would end the vlog now. Um, we had the best three days in Chicago. Despite the weather, we hesitated to actually make it to the trip or cancel or postpone because of how cold it was, but it was honestly the best. I can't wait to come during the summer because everyone has told me that if we liked it in the winter, we would love it even more in the summer so for now it was amazing and i can't wait to see what summer is like but as usual if you like this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel you can also follow me on all my social media all my links will be in the description box down below and i guess i will see you guys for a new video very soon i'll see you guys on the next trip bye